Hi everyone! Mathematics is one of the basic school subjects, but while some people find exact sciences enlightening, others consider them to be incredibly boring. And now, we're going to prove to you that even something as tedious as numbers can be fascinating. Further still, if you do know your maths, you can surprise and entertain your friends at even the lamest of parties. Don't believe us? Then here are seven incredible maths tricks for you. Let's get it on. Reading Minds Ask someone to think of a number between 1 and 20. Let's say it's 8. Then tell him to add up 5 and to multiply the sum by 3. After that, he has to subtract 15 from the result. Now you say, if you tell me what you've got, I'll tell you the number you've thought of. He'll say 24. Divide it by 3, put on your best mysterious face, and psychic style tell him that the sort number is 8. Multiplying by 11 It's really easy to multiply any two-digit number by 11 if you know one little secret. Let's take the number 43. First, add up the digits 4 and 3 and you'll get 7. Now put 7 between 4 and 3 and guess what? You get the result, 473. Doubt it? Well, you can check it in your calculator. Now let's raise the bar and make the same with the number 78. If you do exactly the same thing, which is to add up 7 and 8, you'll get 15. Put it in between 7 and 8, and you'll get 7,158, which is not the right answer. What you actually should do is take the second digit, 5, put it between 7 and 8, and add the 1 to the 7, and you get the right answer, 858. Maybe not everyone caught up with us, so let's review. Multiplying 43 by 11, Add up 4 and 3, get 7, put the sum between 4 and 3, and here's the right answer, 473. Multiplying 78 by 11, add up 7 and 8, get 15, put 5 between 7 and 8, add up the remaining 1 to the first digit, which is 7, and there's the answer, 858. Guessing the age. Let's assume that a friend of yours is 21 years old, but you don't know that. Offer him to multiply his age by 5, add 8 up to this number, and multiply the result by 2. Then he has to subtract 6 from it and multiply by 10. Now ask him to say what he's got. Subtract 100 from this number and divide it by 100. The number you get is the age of your friend. Voila! Instant Squares as you must know, a square is the product of a number being multiplied by itself. For example, 8 squared is the number you get when multiplying 8 times 8, that's 64. Well, that's quite easy. You just have to know your multiplication tables. But how to square two-digit numbers? Turns out it's not so complicated, when it involves numbers ending in 5. Let's take 65. First, you multiply 6 by 7, that is, by the same number plus 1. Then simply put 25 at the end to get a four-digit number. Thus, we get 4,225, which is the square of 65. See? Quite simple. Unfortunately, this only works with numbers ending in 5. Fibonacci Sequence The Fibonacci numbers, also called the Fibonacci Sequence, are characterized by the fact that every number after the first two is the sum of the two preceding numbers. So, ask your friend to write two different numbers, the bigger one on top of the smaller one. Meanwhile, stay aside so your friend would not think you're peeking. Now tell him to sum up the numbers and write down the result below, then to sum up again the last two numbers and write down the result. Let him continue until ten numbers are written down in a column. Then you come up and write the sum of all the numbers right away. Your friend may check if he wants, it will match. Imagine how surprised he'll be. Because you, genius, add up 10 numbers in just a few seconds. And here's the secret. All you have to do is multiply the seventh number by 11, which you already know how to do, by the way. The number you get is also the result of summarizing all the 10 numbers your friend wrote. Guessing the result. And for dessert, the coolest trick. With this one, you'll really blow your friend's minds. Now, take a sheet and write down a six-digit number. Ask your friend to write another six-digit number below, and the digits should be preferably all different. Then you write another number under that. 
Someone else will write another number below and you too. Now offer someone to sum up all five numbers. When the result is written down, you take a piece of paper out of your pocket, and wow, the same number is written on it already. What the heck, man, are you a freaking wizard? Will say your friends, completely shocked. But there's an explanation, and it doesn't involve any magic. So, what's the secret? Let's take a look at the second and the third numbers. The second is written down by your friend, and the third by you, remember? Summed up, these numbers have to equal 999,999. It means that you have to write a number which, added up to the second one, would equal 999,999. The same has to happen with the last two numbers. Therefore, the sum of the last four numbers will equal 999,999 multiplied by 2. That is 1,999,998. So, before the trick, you have to choose a 7-digit number bigger than 1,999,998, write it down on a piece of paper, and put it in your pocket. Don't forget that the first number in the sheet should be the result of subtracting 1,999,998 from your 7-digit number, so memorize it correctly. If you're careful enough and don't make any mistake, the sum of the five numbers will be equal to the one you have in your pocket. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks and we'll be right back to you as fast as we can.